Welcome to the video. In this video I want to show you a little bit of equipment that we've been using here for the past couple of weeks. It's the latest version of something that we occasionally have to pull out in order to inspect circuit boards. But this one is actually from Hobby King and it's pretty inexpensive. We actually ordered it with the last things that we got from those guys. It was only about £26-£27. It's actually a little USB microscope. Now my wife has used these kind of things in the past with uh, children that she teaches in science lessons to look at things like pollen. And when I saw those original older ones, they weren't as sophisticated as this, I kind of got one as well. And that one finally gave up the ghost, so I've been trying this one out. But I thought it was a good idea to actually show you these things in action, because occasionally you need to look at something nice and close up, particularly when you're doing something like checking soldering or links or making sure there's no shorts on a board. And this is a perfect way to do it. Now I do have things like a magnifying glass and those kind of pieces as well and unfortunately as I'm getting a little bit older my eyesight isn't as good really close up as it used to be so I'm having to use things like a magnifying glass for close up hobby work but even those can't get close enough and clear enough for me to see exactly what's going on. So here's the actual thing itself. So uh, turn the LED down. It's looked like this little barrel thing. It has a button on the top to take the picture and uh, it has an LED in it that you can change the intensity with that slider. And this thing is a focus ring. In the kit you also get this little pad to put things on and an attachment too. Now, what I've uh, found is that it is very handy. Let me just kind of zoom in. The focal length is really short, but then it, you'd expect it to be. There we go put a little bit of light on the subject because reflections are not doing me any favours. There we go. So uh, zooming in you can actually see, in fact let me take a picture of that and we can look at it in the video. Just click on take picture. You can also take videos with it as well. So at this distance it's very easy for you to move things around. There's a bit of lag between it. There's the barometer on the bottom on this uh, Nase 32 revision 5 board and it's very easy you can see the individual components um, you can also go right up to stuff as well it kind of goes from kind of 60 times to 250 times if I want to see something really close up so let's have another look at that barometer if I hold it right on top and then just the focus ring that's how close we can get it let me take another picture we can actually see through the whole of the barometer, you can see the individual pins and everything. So I just wanted to uh, share this with you because um, I'm quite impressed with this. This is quite good. In fact, my wife's actually thinking of potentially ordering a couple for school for science lessons because um, it's probably something that wouldn't survive a lot of abuse for um, primary school children. But for things like this in the hobby, when you're trying to troubleshoot or like in the series that we just did where we actually did some very fine soldering around a flight controller because we were limited in space, this was fantastic. It allowed me to pop that board underneath and make sure that everything was okay and that I hadn't shorted everything out and didn't have any dry joints as well. So if you're in the hobby and you are looking to get yourself a good set of kit, definitely worthwhile having a look at this because when you're troubleshooting and you need to see something really close up, this is the best thing I've tried. Thank you for taking the time to watch that video. There are lots of other videos on the channel and they're carefully ordered into playlists. So you may find that there are other videos on this same subject that you can go and watch. So I would recommend going into the playlist area of Painless360 YouTube channel and looking around and seeing what there is. You never know what you might find. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and happy flying.